Hmm. How am I going to get in there? I demand to be let in. I'm sorry. That's impossible. But my girlfriend is inside. I understand that, but I can't let you in. Can I at least go find her? Sadly, no. Why not? Because the club is full. Nobody else is allowed. Well, can you go find her for me? I must stay here. Then can you send someone to find her? Everyone is busy. You will just have to wait. I want to speak to someone in charge. As I said, everyone is busy. If you come back tomorrow after 10 a.m., perhaps you can speak with someone then. But my girlfriend is in there now. Perhaps you should have come together. Then you would not be in this situation, and I would not have to listen to you shouting at me. I'm just getting warmed up. It's not my fault that you're out here and she is in there. It is your fault. She is your girlfriend. You should have known better than to ask her to wait for you inside a club that is known to fill up every single night. Can I please just go and find her? I said no and I meant it. Now go away or I will call the police. Schweinhund. Scheiß cough. Hey baby, wanna dance? I'm always too late to get in. I've been waiting out here for 20 minutes. I hope the performance is good. Leave me alone. Is it always as crowded? Yeah. The place fills up every night. People come for the music. Do you think they'll let us in? I doubt it. I have to get in there. Really? Well, let me help you. I'll distract the bouncer so you can climb in through that window. Watch out for the camera, though. Thanks. My pleasure. Have fun. Hello, big boy. And hello there. It sure is crowded tonight. It usually is. This place is very popular. You must meet a lot of pretty girls. Yes, but rarely do I meet enchanting ones. You're teasing. I do not tease. Promises, promises. We get off in an hour. Then so do I. Your place or mine? Let's start at your place and see where we end up. I like your style. See you soon. I'll count every minute. for this evening. Thank you, thank you. Perhaps I will sing for you later. What is so important you need to interrupt me in the middle of a performance? You know how these people treasure my concerts. Now they will lament. Das tut mir leid, Fräulein Wagner. Of course, if they are sad, they will buy more drinks to drown their sorrows which is good for business. But it troubles me to know that someone is unhappy because I was unable to give enough of myself. A gift like mine comes with terrible responsibility, you know. Yeah, and you have so much of yourself to give. Even such pathetic, horrible creatures as these smelly beatniks deserve some sympathy, yeah? Now then, perhaps you will care to remind me why I am talking instead of singing. Fräulein Wagner, the super spy is here. What should we do? So, the fly has rung the doorbell of the spider. You did the right thing. Let her have a few drinks. Then she goes to the water closet. Grab her and bring her to me. Am I understood? Jawohl. Good. Watch her closely. She is not to leave under any circumstances. It will be done as you have asked. 
If you succeed, perhaps I will be convinced to sing for you. Would you like that? Very much so, Fräulein Wagner. It would be a great honor. Then make me happy. When I am happy, I sing like a night and gale in springtime. I love your outfit. I do too. Can I talk you out of it? <laughs> These cramps are killing me. I wonder where my boyfriend is. He asked me to meet him here. Perhaps it's just me, but I thought the music was terrible. How can you say that? This club is super groovy. Don't you think so? Would you care for a light? Thanks, but I don't smoke. You're holding a cigarette. Am I? Well, what do you know? I guess old habits die hard. Say, can I borrow a dime? I want to call my mom and tell her I just met the girl of my dreams. I gave my last dime to a worthwhile charity. Ouch. I wasn't expecting a woman. You weren't briefed. They just said meet Agent Archer at 8 p.m. Well, I'm Agent Archer. So I gathered. Didn't the code phrase tip you off? I thought it was a little unusual, but I figured, hey, it's Europe. Things are different over here. Scotch and soda. Will you have a drink? Old Granddad, bring the bottle, a tumbler, and a bowl of ice. Goodness, are you celebrating? Compensating, actually. How sad for you. So tell me, Ms. Archer. Oh, now don't start with that. What? There's no need to patronize me. Was I patronizing you? Yes, you were. Well, I'm sorry, but I didn't realize I was going to have to babysit on this assignment. I may be a woman, but that doesn't mean I can't take care of myself. Oh, I get it. You're one of those women's livers. Dress up in men's clothing, ride motorcycles, smoke cigars, that kind of thing. Just because I can take care of myself doesn't mean I'm not a woman. They're not mutually exclusive, you know. But isn't the point of women's liberation to allow young ladies like yourself to become men? The point is to allow young ladies to become whatever they please. Ouch. Well, if you're as deadly with a pistol as you are with your tongue, you can watch both our backs. All right, I will. So what's the plan? Well, the first thing is to find out who the goon is.